What's with the Republican Party at being outraged at people pointing out sexual harassment within their midst? You're just so outraged. The Daily Wire is putting out this video saying the FBI should, uh, they should investigate Ford. You're outraged that people are questioning your morals. Well, guess what? The Republican Party has no fucking morals. You've got no morals. You can't claim that being anti-abortion makes you moral. Sorry. The Republican Party doesn't give a shit about anyone after they're born unless they're rich. Morals? You think you're the party of morals? And you get more and more outraged the more that people point out that whole frat boy mentality, that whole grabber by the pussy mentality. You want to put that up on a pedestal because that's, that's your good old boys, right? Can't say anything bad about that. How can some of you possibly wonder how people look at the Republican Party as being the anti-woman party? Are you really that stupid that you can't understand? Who cares what happens to women? That's essentially what the Republican Party's platform is. Who cares what happens to women? While you all work really hard to try to bring us back to the 1950s. Yeah, the, the Republican Party has no morals, I'm sorry. And I think back to the 90s when, you know, they continually campaign under Family values, family values, family values, family values. Now what is it? Well, we're against people accusing Republicans of sexual harassment. That makes us moral. You know, when, when the only thing that you can, you can take claim on, uh, on being moral, is that you're not acting like Antifa, when that's the only thing that you can claim that makes you somehow more moral, that's pretty fucking sad. Antifa are a fringe group on the left. The people that are... <laughs> that have power are not just some fringe group on the right. They're the ones who have power. They're the ones that are making laws. They're the ones that have no morals. But look! Look this person over here! Look what they're doing at a college campus! Look out! Look, the Democrats have no morals because look at Antifa! Grab him by the pussy after all, right? That's cool. Oh, but, but, but it was in the past. It doesn't matter. It just kind of seems like Republicans want to look at women as objects. Women are objects that should not have power. Because when you give them power, they complain about the way that men treat them. You can't have that, right? Got to be traditional. The traditional way of looking at women, you know? That women have no agency. You shouldn't worry about women's agency. They're just things that make babies. Make me a baby. Make me a sandwich. So don't judge Republicans on their virtue signaling. Their virtue signaling is pure bullshit. Judge them on their actions when it comes to what they want to pass in law. When it comes to who they support. What they actually support. There could be video evidence and these people would still say, well, you know, well, you know, boys will be boys. That's what it would eventually come down to. That's how this works. The misogynist frat boy mentality kind of thing will be defended at all costs. The focus will all be about, oh, look at these men's lives who were ruined. They were doing such so great in sports. They, they had such a future. Who cares about the women, right? This is why, this is why the Republican Party is looked at as misogynistic, why it's looked at as the party of old, rich, white men. Because the things that these old white men were able to do when they were young, they want to do everything they can to support a system that still allows for that kind of thing. And they'll defend it at any cost. If the absolute defense of that kind of thing at any cost isn't misogyny, and isn't a form of, uh, the patriarchy in some way, then I don't know what is.